Good morning, I'm Paul from Northern Golf and I'm going to explain to you how to repair the uh, Axglow Trialite brake system. So uh, we'll just start with the top part first, well actually we'll start with the bottom part. Because it's more often than not it's human error. If we can uh, just show you of taking the bottom part off. It's, uh, just get the right size screwdriver to take these uh, screws out obviously and once these um, get themselves out and what we're finding is that people when they're engaging the, the brake they're actually pushing the brake lever upwards instead of down and that's just causing strain on the cable and it's um, unfortunately breaking Nearly there on the last one. There we go. There's the last one out. And what you'll find on the underside of that is a little hole underneath the brake mechanism. And there's a little Allen key. Um, get yourself a set of Allen keys. Out she comes. Try not to let it all the way out. Don't want to lose that little fella. And there's your cable out of the way. Okay, back to the top of the trolley now. The brake system there. It's all loose now. So ideally, we can get in there with a screwdriver. We can play that apart just a big one. A little bit wider. We get in there. It's unfortunately there's no easy way around this. But we'll we'll prevail. Trying to get that little barrel out that you can see there. It's a bit fiddly, but we'll get there. And we're out. So there's that little fella. Go there. Get that out. Bring in your spare cable. Feed it back down the housing. There she goes. Put the barrel back in there. We'll get there. Get your pliers. Squeeze together. Again, a little bit fiddly, just hold it in place, squeeze together, squeeze together. We're getting there with that one. Okay. Put that in the uh, down position that you can see there. So that's back in position. And back down to our brake system down the bottom. She's popped out. So again, remember that the brake system is the down position because as you can see, if you watch the actual, so that's got to be pushed out, brake system down, put the new device on there, new brake device, and then tighten the Allen key. You can see where we're heading here. Best way to do that I've found is actually make sure the uh, four screws are in place before you start putting the uh,
Okay, she's in place. Back over the holes. Back in with the screwdriver. Pretty straightforward putting these back in. Just hold the back side, give it a bit of so the they are fairly small the screws, so you don't want the uh, screwdriver to be slipping and then lose the heads on them. So you you know we're going to get them out again. Get in there. Last one. Baby up. Right, done job. She goes. And now we've got a brake system that works. There she works. Super. Hopefully that's been helpful to you. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you. Bye bye.